for Joe Flacco. Raheem Moore recovers. Well, in the season, he's lost four. This is home. Around the outside and out of bounds. Just shy of the Baltimore 40-yard line. Baltimore 42. They fake to him. Inside the 35. And again with Tom throwing to the sideline and has his man at the 15 yard line. Brandon Stokely with the catch. Playing with the market out of bounds at about the 17. You can penalize Denver five yards. And he's going to the outside. And he's going to be tied in. Wrestling out of bounds just inside the 15. Brendan Ian Badejo. Just inside the 10 to Demarius Thomas, but that is not going to be enough for a first down. They stall inside the 20. From 27 yards out, gives Denver the first lead of the day. 3 0 Bronco. Gets his right hand on the football, not even close to interfering with Demarius Thomas, a big guy at 6'3, and Kerry Williams, a tall corner at 6'1 in the NFL. Oh. Straight ahead, inside the 25. Pushing across the 20 to the 19 yard. Well, that was a heck of a job by the backups, the guys that the play had already passed them for Denver. They got behind Moreno and shoved him forward. To about the 18. Welcome back to Baltimore, everybody. I, there's no question that Eric Decker's left foot is out of bounds before he touches the pylon with the ball. The important thing... Did After break reviewing the play. the play, the receiver had control of the ball and stepped out of bounds. The ball will be placed at the half-yard line. It is not a touchdown. Thanks. <laughs>
with the touchdown and the celebration. And a 10 0 Denver lead. at that. He was looking at Bolden the whole way and telegraphed that throw. The end of the first half, Denver 17, Baltimore nothing. Back with the Verizon halftime report after this message and a word from your local station. This is each yard. 25, and out of bounds at about the 45-yard line. Terrific return once again from Jacoby Jones. Stands, it's an incomplete pass. It's fourth down. Let me correct and what happened Baltimore as we went to a timeout there. Another official came up and ruled this an incompletion and not a complete pass, and it was John Harbaugh who threw the challenge flag. And then Torrey Smith hits his head when he hits the ground. He tries to get up, and Torrey Smith, suffering the effects of slamming his head onto the turf, ends up going into the Ravens' locker room. The Ravens on the board for the first time today. Straight enough and long enough. 12 18 to play in the third. The Ravens' first points of the day, 17 3. Three or four yards deep in his own end zone. Lost the football. Riley toward the sideline. Who covered it? Nobody. The ball's out of bounds. And Denver's going to keep it. Enough for a first down. Check next week. Straight ahead. And out to close to the 44 yard line before Ed Reed makes the stop.
Marshawn Moreno up over 100 yards, 31-3, Denver. Goss. Right up the middle of the field. Breaking free, one man to beat. And he's tackled at the 36-yard line. Flacco on third and five. He throws out here, and that's incomplete intended for Rice, covered by that man, Wesley Wood. Dropping the pass, or number 30. 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. David Bruton guilty of the penalty. Hey, just will not take. That won't fly. From the 16-yard line, Flacco. Running left, running for his right, and threw it away with his left hand. Von Miller giving chase. <laughs> And I tell you, Joe Flacco. No foul for intentional grounding as the quarterback got the ball beyond the line of scrimmage. However, after the play, personal foul, unnecessary roughness, late hit, number 81, the offense. 15 yard penalty and the down will count. Second down. So it gives Flacco and the Ravens a second and 25. And Flacco right up the middle. Oh, what a catch! Inside the five by Pena and into the end zone was a touch. I don't think he was. They're checking at the goal line as to whether he was touched or not. Touchdown! Discern that Mike Adams actually touches it. Whichever way it goes, heck of a catch by Dennis Pitta. Here's which, would make, which would make him down. After reviewing the play, the ruling on the field stands. It's a touchdown. Right. Get another touchdown. All of a sudden, 31-17 with the amount of time left. It's in right. That Pittsburgh loss would give the Ravens a playoff spot, not necessarily and not yet the division championship. Apple, 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 Midfield, they're just nosing into. Gilman gets the first down. And again, again, Den. Here come the Ravens. Manning throwing sideline. Double complete. First down. Wrestled out of bounds with a flag. Yeah, Terry Williams. Terry Williams looks like he, he stumbled trying to come back in to make the play and then well out of bounds. Play and after the play, after the play was over, personal foul, unnecessary roughness, late hit, throwing the player out of bounds. 15 yard penalty, automatic first down. This drive is a demonstration of what really good football teams can do. He takes this all the way down to the five second mark on the play block and then Hillman finds a hole to the 12. Off right. somehow. Don't don't throw dirt on the Ravens yet. That, that would be free to do. Come on, man. And now to bring out the people of you. Defensive football team has got to come out of this game with zero confidence. Crater from 36 yards out here, right down the middle. Three more on the board for the Broncos. It's 34 to 10. And Peyton Manning on the sideline, 421. All that stands in the way of the Broncos. And there's Dennis Pitta breaking free up the sideline. Pitta to the 10, the 5, the touchdown. Well, that's one of the best efforts of the year by Dennis Pitta. And that's, that's one of the best efforts of the year that I've seen. That is a tremendous today. Onside kick. And grab by Matthew Willis, a wide receiver for the Denver Broncos. Go to his job as Isaac Newsom has been at his. Hurry, hurry, check! This is Philbin. Philbin. Brought down at the 45 yard line, and Baltimore cannot stop the clock anymore. Sack, Mark. What do you Flacco goes to the near side, and that's complete to Jacoby Jones. And Flacco going down, 
back at the 10-yard line. Oh, and Joe Flacco just couldn't find an opening. On third and 13, the pass to the far side to David Reed, and Champ Bailey runs him out of bounds. But they were two and three. And they haven't lost the game since that point. That fourth down pass falls incomplete, and the ball will go over on downs to the Broncos. I would to take this personally. This is just the way you got to finish off the drive. 45 yards out, that kick is clear to the left, and no good. Three and a nine game winning streak. Right. And not exactly playing a couple power out. And Flacco going down. Robert Ayers from behind. And it won't be a very happy New York Giants team. And Flacco down again to end the game. And there's Elvis Doomerville. Elvis Doomerville gets around Michael Lohr, and that was an ugly finish and an unfortunate finish for John Harbaugh's Baltimore Ravens. Again, we said it early, it has been a long time since I've seen a team that was missing as much defensive talent as the Ravens were today.